This is Rosemary, our coil winding demonstrator. The newly designed spin winder CNC is the production equivalent of up to four single spindle machines. The new CNC controller eliminates the need for a dedicated counter as that function is built in. Just program in the number of turns, the wire size, winding width, high speed and low speed RPM, and some other basic winding parameters and you are ready to wind highly accurate and repeatable coils. Conventional coil winding machines rotate the bobbin, pulling the wire onto the bobbin. The spin winder holds the bobbin stationary and spins the wire onto the bobbin with a pair of fly winding heads. Point to the derailleur, Rosemary. When loading the wire, the wire comes from the derailleur, is directed to the back of the machine where it is fed into and through the motor shaft, which is hollow. An insertion tool is provided for this action. Show us the motor with the insertion tool, Rosemary. Thank you. From there it feeds into one of three basic types of winding heads. Show us the three winding heads, Rosemary. For small bobbins, we offer the needle head with a small diameter ceramic wire guide. For, uh, for mid-sized bobbins, we have our standard winding head with a ceramic wire guide which comes in varying widths. For larger bobbins with heavier wire, we have a wide standard winding head which utilizes roller bearings for the final directing of wire to the bobbin. A major advantage of the spin winder is that the finished lead of each bobbin becomes a start lead of the next bobbin without further attention of the operator. Please rotate the uh, turret, Rosemary, to demonstrate. Thank you. Another advantage of the spin winder is that it lends itself readily to winding difficult bobbins, such as greatly unbalanced forms or unusual shapes, which are difficult to hold safely for high-speed rotation. Thank you, Rosemary. You can begin winding coils, Rosemary. The dual head turret, which is unique with the Gorman spin winder, is constructed so that one pair of tooling is facing the winding pliers in a position to be wound, while the other pair is facing the operator. After two coils are wound on the pair facing the machine, the whole turret can be vertically rotated 180 degrees to present a new pair of empty bobbins to the winding heads. The just wound bobbins are presented to the operator for removal. A set of new bobbins can be mounted to be ready for winding when the current set is finished. The winding heads can stop within a tenth of a rotation to main clearance as the turret rotates the tooling with the bobbins. Please start the machine again, Rosemary. The increased production possibilities are apparent over conventional methods in that the winding operation on two bobbins is going on during finishing operations. The only downtime of the machine is the few seconds it takes to flip the turret over. All controls are directly before the operator for ease of operation. Rugged construction throughout ensures years of trouble-free production. Wire sizes from 24 gauge to the finest can be wound. Coil sizes up to 2.5 inch diameter and coil lengths up to 5 inch can be wound. The spin winder has a speed range of up to 8,000 RPM. The controller accepts start slow and end slow speeds. Thank you for the demonstration, Rosemary.